Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now, this is a general reading so it may not resonate with everybody. So please do take whatever resonates with you and the rest of it, just leave it aside. If you feel as though it doesn't quite make sense with you, you're not feeling comfortable with it, then just leave it there. It is most likely not meant for you. If, however, you would like to have your own personal reading, please do contact me at romancevilletarot at gmail.com and it will be my great pleasure to send you the different type of readings that I can offer you so that we can go and find those answers that you're seeking for. So, um, that being said, if you do enjoy the channel and you have not yet subscribed, please do take a brief moment of your time to click onto the subscribe button to show your support to the channel and to myself and it would be mostly appreciated. So with no further ado, we're going to begin this reading here. This reading I find really important. I titled it Must Hear Love Messages from Your Partner because, you know, we're always talking about the negative and, well, not always, but often we have negative, you know, um, we, we're looking for uh, information when we're more into the negative, when we're into the down periods. And so I thought it was very important once in a while to just do a reading but on everything that could be positive within your relationship because that's what a relationship is about it's about being positive it's about being in love and it's about doing good things otherwise why would we be in a relationship right so these here are um i have about seven eight different tarot decks here oracle decks actually who have messages for you they are love messages from your partner so this is all information that your partner would like you to know but doesn't really say maybe they were shy maybe i mean for different various reasons they're just not saying it out loud so i'm here to tell you so and i'm going to finish it up with a little oracle card here of heart and soul so let's begin i have very soon playfulness, confidence, happiness, clarity. This card just doesn't want to stay. Let's put it there. I have within the next few months, forgiveness, meditation brings answers, cleansing, grounding, and over here, I have exertion, I have healing, I have knowledge, inner temple, and I have blossoming. Okay, so let's get with the messages from your partner here. So your partner would like you to um, to clearly decide what it is that you want so that it comes to you. So this is all about maybe they're feeling once in a while like you don't really know what it is that you want or maybe it just seems that way. Um, or maybe you've actually just expressed it out loud that you're not sure that this relationship, you know, is really what is good for you. Maybe you even said it during a fight. That could be. But they would really just like you to clearly decide what it is that you want so that everybody, you know, can get together for it. So you can start moving towards it. So they can start moving towards it so your partnership can and the universe can start sending you that energy out so you can start moving forward so you can move instead of staying a little bit in stagnation they feel like their relationship is a little bit in stagnation mode right now um and they would love to have a little bit more playfulness into the um, into the relationship. They find as though, you know, they, they love you and everything, but they would like to have a little bit more passion maybe. So maybe it's time to recapture the romance. You need to allow your inner youthful spirit to just, you know, of fun to just shine, do some things that you haven't done in a long time maybe, or, or, you know, if it is going out that you like to do, go do that. Whatever it is, that could spike a little bit of a flame, a little extra, you know, go for it. Um, blossoming, your relationship is blossoming and they do want to continue this relationship with you. So this is really good. They want you to know that everything with them in the relationship is good and they are happy. So they want to continue this relationship and they want to continue blossoming with you. Um, I, there are a couple little problems, a little a couple little conflicts within the relationship and that's completely normal. The angels here want to say that within the next few months but this should dissipate it should go away um, everything should put its, itself back in place but of course you're gonna have to work on it your partner also um, but you do need have to you do need have to I'm sorry you have to work on your forgiveness okay it seems as though there are some things from the past that you're not forgiving they're there it's bothering you and um, it's showing itself into the relationship 
forgive. So your partner would like you to maybe work on that forgiveness, let go of the past. Let's live into the present, not even necessarily living into the future. I want you to live into the present. Um, so let's forget about the past. Let Do whatever it is that you have to do in order to forgive if it is not forgiven. You can't just say, okay, I'm going to forget about it. You need to actually do the actions so it is forgotten and you move forward. Um, and if ever you are in, in need of any information, meditation brings answers. So if you can take a little bit of moment by yourself, figure things out, meditation, intuition, absolutely fantastic. It has all the answers. You have every single answer that you need. You just don't really know about it. So let's go for it. Let's go get that meditation. Let's go get those answers that you're searching for. And it does great. If ever you're having a conflict, you're having a fight, go away, meditate, be with yourself, go with the inner self. You'll see you're going to find peace. Um, cleansing. So this is all about a renewal a little bit into the relationship. So as I was saying, they would like you to, to forgive. Um, and so this is all about maybe uh, doing that, doing a cleansing a little bit of the relationship to get rid of whatever's old, whatever's not necessary, whatever is negative, and just keeping in the positive to keep on moving. They would like a little bit like the flowers over here in the blossoming. Um, they would like to have a little bit more grounding in the relationship. They would like to maybe the roots to go into the ground a little bit more to have a little bit more security to have to have that relationship with you that is shown you know that is more serious um I have over here exertion. They feel they're afraid for you every once in a while. They feel as though maybe you're working a little bit too hard. You do a little bit too much. Maybe between work, maybe between exercises and friends and everything. They feel like you just go all the way to the end sometimes and that there's no room after. You're just going to fall right off. So they would like you to try and be careful about that. Again, I have the healing card. You necessarily definitely have to heal. You have to get rid of anything that is hurting you from this relationship or from the past. It must leave because I've had it already like three times here um, and knowledge they want to know more about you they want you to communicate more they want to know about you they want to know more about you they want to get some more information because you know they they love you and they care about you and they want to share more things with you so they, they want to discover you is what they want to do so that's always a nice compliment to receive and um, they want you to have confidence confidence is having the belief in yourself to keep on going and the self-assurance to get you there they want you to have that self-confidence to move forward they want you to have that confidence within you also so you can get to your goal so your relationship can get to the path that you want to go to um, they want you to know that they're happy they want you all that they want is your happiness okay they want your happiness they want your joy and they would like to have a little bit more of clarity they would like to have a little bit more information sometimes you're upset they don't really know why they want to have a little bit more clarity so you know there could be a little bit less arguing every once in a while so, um, and I have the inner temple here, which is devotion. So they want you to know that they truly are devoted to you. So that being said, I'm going to um, read you the Oracle Heart and Soul. Every challenge provides an opportunity to discover a deep meaning to life. Each challenge can bring a, can be a gateway to something greater. Use your intuitive and creative powers. Many solutions exist. Move beyond fear and you'll discover that there are no limits apart from the limits that we ourselves have placed. So this is the ending of this reading. I do hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that it resonated with you. If you do have any questions, you would like to have a personal reading, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. Um, please don't forget to stay tuned for any following readings. And I do wish you a fantastic day. Many, many blessings. And I will be seeing you soon with more readings. Have a great day.